Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna be doing a really fun recipe. I'm excited for this one. It's gonna be a honey chipotle chicken and we're gonna to top it with some cheese and some bacon so we can't go wrong. We're gonna be smoking this on the Traeger today. So let's go ahead and get our marinade started. I'm gonna start by kind of cleaning up this chicken a little bit. Chase went and got some chicken at a restaurant supplier and this chicken, these chicken breasts are huge. So I'm just gonna kind of clean them up and get them ready to go in the marinade. Look at the size of these, they're huge. I really think by now that I would uh, remember to put my phone on silent. Forget every time. Seriously. Get this out of my way. Okay, so for our marinade, we are going super simple. Um, I'm doing honey chipotle. Uh, so we're going to use some of our Mad Dogs Old Yeller. We're going to start with that. Just something to help that rub bond. Just start with that. Just kind of roll these around and give them a little barbecue bath. And now we're going to be using the Heath Riles. This is the Chipotle, Honey Chipotle open. Alright, we're going to go in heavy. Heavy handed. Both sides. Alright, we got everything good and coated, so I'm going to cover these and we're going to stick them into the refrigerator until we are ready to cook. It'll probably be an hour or two um, just to kind of sit and let them marinate. So I'll see you guys here shortly. Traeger, it has been about two and a half hours since we uh, marinated our chicken. Get these right here onto the Traeger. I can tell you now, these suckers are going to be good. They smell so freaking good. That Chipotle. Oh my gosh. Okay. So now we're going to let those cook. I've got it at 350 degrees until they get the temperature. Alright, we are back. I've got the chicken off the Traeger. It is at internal temperature now. I'm going to go ahead and take some of our old yeller. We're just going to give this a good old drizzle right across each chicken. Oh yeah, that looks good. And then I've got some bacon that I browned up and we're just going to crumble that right on top. Can't go wrong with adding some bacon. The Mad Dog's Old Yeller and Bacon is one of my favorite flavor combinations. They work so well together. I can tell you now, this is going to be amazing. Now we're going to top it with some cheese. And then these are going to go back out into the Traeger just long enough to melt the cheese. Our chicken's going to be ready to go. Oh yeah. I'm going in with some sharp cheddar because cheddar is better. All right, so I'm going to take this on out of the Traeger. I'm just going to leave them on this pan and we're going to get these all nice, melty, and bubbly. And oh, I can't wait. Everything is off the Traeger, and you guys just don't understand 
how amazing all of this smells. My mouth is watering. This, this is gonna be a great dinner. I'm so excited for this. All right. So we've got our honey chipotle chicken. I just cut into this one. It is so juicy. Oh my gosh, you guys. These, I love doing it like this because they are so juicy. They don't get dry in the least. Um, but I can smell that chipotle and then we've got the bacon and cheese, which just always makes everything just so much better. All right. Let's get in here and get this taste test. Bacon, some cheese. Oh my goodness. Right. <laughs> Dang, that's good. Oh my gosh. I'm trying not to talk in my mouthful. Ooh. That's your boy's got a good hip. Good kick. Yeah, it's not like super spicy, but that chipotle's got a little bit of a kick now. That is so good. All right, y'all. I'm going to have to cut this short because I'm hungry. But thank you for watching. If you have any suggestions as to a recipe or something you'd like to see us do, let us know in the comments below. Make sure to click subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one.